Vice Chancellor, uh, Minister, ladies and gentlemen, first of all, let me thank Germany for accepting uh, the invitation and the challenge to be the honor country of the Thessaloniki International Fair 2024. And I refer to the challenge because um, um, Dr. Habeck, you're right to point out that we presented you with a very big space to fill. And if it were not for the very strong business and economic ties between our two countries, I don't think that would have been possible. But the fact that we have 130 companies present here, open to the public to explain their own stories and the strong economic ties that we have between Greece and Germany is exactly testimony to the fact that we have built a very strong economic bilateral partnership. And um, you are right to point out that you know, our historic relationships have gone through ebbs and flows. And it is also true that as Greece was going through its own uh, financial crisis, the views of uh, Germany were sometimes um, uh, distorted by the pain that the Greek citizens felt. But the truth is that we've left these years behind us. The Greek economy uh, is now growing very fast, which means that it presents lots of opportunities for German companies to have a presence in Greece and to invest in Greece. And we should not forget that Germany is one of the biggest foreign investors in Greece. And we should also not forget that during the years of the crisis, the German companies actually stayed in Greece. They did not leave and they invested, they continue to invest uh, in the country. So this fair is an opportunity to strengthen our bilateral economic ties, to identify new opportunities, but also because this, as you pointed out, is a rare universal public fair. They don't tend to exist these days. For the people of Thessaloniki and for all the visitors to come, have fun, enjoy themselves, get to know what the German companies are actually doing uh, in Greece. And I should point out that uh, at the bilateral level, there's an excellent cooperation between uh, Greece and Germany. Uh, we're faced with uh, tremendous challenges. Uh, the Vice Chancellor, for those of you who don't know it, is particularly sensitive when it comes to issues of the green transition uh, and, uh, and climate change. We have been directly affected by the climate crisis, as most Mediterranean countries have. And as we move into the next uh, European uh, cycle, there's going to be a lot of interesting discussions that we have uh, in terms of how we actually make the green transition a reality without compromising on, on our targets, while at the same time maintaining the competitiveness and national security of our industries while supporting the people who actually suffer from the climate crisis today. Not an easy equation to solve, uh, but we know we have good and qualified partners uh, when we engage in this debate. So, uh, again, um, uh, dear uh, uh, Robert, Minister, thank you so much uh, for being um, uh, here. It means a lot to us to have Germany as a country of, uh, of honor. And I'm uh, sure that uh, for all of those, because this is actually a fair that receives lots and lots of visitors who visit the, the German pavilion, I'm sure they'll also you know, have a very, very good time. And I'm eager to present the pavilion to the visitors of TIFF. So thank you again very much for being here.